On Sunday afternoon, at least 12 fire departments spent several hours battling a fast-moving house fire in Dover Foxcroft. It spread very quickly. We were amazed at how fast it spread. According to the Dover Foxcroft Fire Department, ring camera footage revealed that the fire started when a GFI outlet on the exterior of the home failed. They had just spent the year fixing it up and they had um, uh, animals um, around and was setting it up like a farmstead. Carol and Eric Boothroyd live across the street and called 911 after seeing the flames. The home belonged to Tyson and Amanda Ober and their children, who were not home at the time of the fire. Tyson is a well-known police officer in the Dover Foxcroft community. Tyson has been a member of the police department here for uh, many years. He's just somebody that the community knows and uh, respects. Police Chief Seth Burns says members of the community have already begun donating to the officer and his family. When we got back to the station, we found that uh, our front porch was already covered with bins and bags of clothes and toys and various items. And several donations have been made to the fire station as well. To be part of a small community that everybody comes together in a time of need. We've had tons of people coming in, dropping off bags, clothes, books, money. Um, it's, it's a great feeling. An account has been set up in the family's name at the Maine Highlands Federal Credit Union in Dover Foxcroft. Donations can be dropped off anytime at the police or fire station, and links to a GoFundMe page can also be found at foxbangor.com. The volume of support that we've that's been coming directly to us, um, it's it's a tremendous thing to see, and we certainly appreciate it at the police department, and I know the the Ober family does as well. In Dover Foxcroft, Grace Blanchard for ABC7 and Fox 22 News.